Hey, this is Big Hardcore, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix an issue which I found on the PC version of Metro Exodus with a with an AMD graphics card. Right, so I actually booked the day off on release date to play this game. Got up nice and early to install the game because it wasn't available till 5 a.m. Went to play it, and it just would not work. Can you imagine how pissed off I was, considering I've been waiting for this game for so long? Now, what was happening was, it was playing the um, intro video, it would start off um, in the sewers, and I would literally move move for about 30 seconds, and then the image would just freeze, and would completely lock up my system. I couldn't do nothing, I couldn't even alt control delete and go task manager to end it, it literally just killed my system. And the only thing I could do each time was to restart the PC. Um, I I downloaded the latest AMD graphics card drivers. That didn't work, even though they were supposed to um, be optimized for this game. I tried looking for help on forums. But the problem is, I've got the version that came from the Epic's Game Store. And there is no community on there. Um, this is one of the times I actually really do miss Steam for things like this, but we're not going to go into that. Right, so after trying everything, oh, I even tried uninstalling the graphics cards and starting completely from fresh, reinstalling all drivers again, and once again, nothing happened. We got to pretty much the same place, and then it would freeze. Uh, when recording video for the channel, it would freeze a lot earlier. Um, but even when not recording it still just wasn't having it okay so to fix the problem what I ended up doing was going to the AMD settings selecting gaming global settings making sure that for enhanced sorry that for anti aliasing modes is set to enhance application settings I think before it was just set to use application settings before um, set the GPU workload to graphics, mm -hmm. and this I can't pronounce the word, but this <laughs> this setting um, set to use application settings. Make sure OpenGL triple buffering switched off, and same for morphological filtering. Make sure that's switched off. Anti-aliasing method multi sampling. Okay, uh, wait for vertical fresh set to enhance sync. For texture filtering quality, set to standard as well. Right, so you'll also need to change the settings in the game. So go to options and go down to video. Now I've got the resolution set to 1920 by 1080 because it just runs smoother. Um, quality set to medium, V-Sync switched off, motion blur normal. Um, it will automatically set DirectX to DirectX 12 turn that shit off, put it down to DX7, sorry, DX11, it runs a lot better, switch off Airworks, the advanced physics, that's just for NVIDIA cards, I think, switch off tessellation, you'll notice a massive difference, um, texture filter, turn it down to AF4, um, turn the shader, sorry, the shading rate down to 1x, Right, and um, that's pretty much it. So after changing all these settings, the game started running very smoothly. I it, it doesn't crash at all. Before the most I could get was about a minute of gameplay. I've managed to play this game for about five hours now, and haven't had any issues. Now, like I said, I have set it to medium because this is the smoothest it's running I actually saw on the website that for this graphics card it actually runs best on medium but you might want to tweak yours to see if you can get um, extra quality out of it but you know I'm happy with the game as it is right so if you found this video useful and if it managed to get you past your issues that you've been having with the game um, please do me a favor and hit the like button also, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button because I am going to be uploading new videos from Metro Exodus. Plus, I play quite a lot of games and like to make videos for them, so you might see something else you like. Right? Thanks for watching.